on the floor for the visiting team. At center, Anthony Davis. Let's meet your home team. Sports fans, thanks for joining us. It's the NBA. Uh, here we are in November. Let's see how things are shaking out in the West early in the season. Up to a great start this season, currently in second. Now the starting group for the visitors. Anthony Davis is out there with Durant, and it's LeBron James. Then it's Curry, and it's Booker in at the shooting guard position. Olenek is out there with Powell. Then there's Shane Gilgis Alexander. Then there's Jamal Murray. And it's Barrett at the small forward. Well, you're scratching your head with how do you defend a guy like Durant. I mean, his length, his speed, ball handling, all allow him to draw fouls easily. And still so much, Greg, to learn about these teams. When do we get a sense of a team's true identity? Well, not this early in the season. I'd say at least a quarter of the way through it. That's when you kind of get a sense of a squad's chemistry. And that's another area where he is just a superb player. Excellent at the free throw line. And it's Gilgis Alexander missing. Great. Isn't it amazing the way Gilgis Alexander has polished off his game? The footwork, Kevin, is impeccable. Three-level score and makes every shot imaginable. And what's scary, this guy still has another level to get to. Here's Murray. Following the basket by Anthony Davis. Over KD. Murray, no good. Curry against Gilgis Alexander. Curry passes to LeBron. And a great assist LeBron by Curry James. as that one goes in. He's become so comfortable from long range. That shot's now a weapon for LeBron. Here's Gilgis Alexander. Now in the scoring column with that bucket. One for two this game. Yeah, going hard to the rack, making a statement here early on. Yeah, that's how he rolls. I mean, intimidate the opponent right now. Now here's LeBron. LeBron James. Last time out, he had 14 points. points. Delicious dime from Curry there. One of the reasons his teammates love playing with him. To the paint. Here's Gilgis Alexander. That's basket number two with his third shot off to a fast two for three. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Curry against Gilgis Alexander. Curry with the bucket. And this first quarter has been ridiculous. I mean, they simply can't miss right now. Gone two for four from the field so far today. Gilgis Alexander against Curry. And Davis sends it back. That infinite wingspan of Davis is on full display there. Good. LeBron James. LeBron's got eight points. Excellent all-around performance so far. Hence the big lead. Yeah, you know, they've had the advantage at both ends. They've got all the momentum early on. And a double-digit lead That's on the scoreboard as we end the first quarter of play. Your home team. Leading by 10. And we'll be back with you for the start of the second quarter when we return. And 
if you're just tuning in. We've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. And looking at what we've seen so far, guys, from the visiting team, what do you think? They came in on a mission, razor-sharp offense in that first period. Yeah, I agree. That was a flawless offensive performance so far. I mean, the shots have been falling. They're making good decisions. That's a nice recipe there. We've got Shane Gilgis Alexander. Andrew Wiggins is out there with Lou George. And it's Alexander Walker into the two-guard position. Gilgis Alexander can't get it to go. Gilgis Alexander's gone two of six here tonight from the field. We've got Tatum. Damian Lillard out there with Kyrie Irving. And it's Durant. And it's Butler in at the small forward position. Irving. And it's blocked by Gilgis Alexander. And this is active defense. Gilgis Alexander hustling to alter that shot. It's hauled in by Kevin Durant. Their game plan needs to change if they're going to get out of this hole because he is just not there offensively. Gilgis Alexander looking around. Pass to Alexander Walker to the middle. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. You have to love the unselfishness on display there. Excellent passing. 55 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Lillard, the pass to Tatum. Ah, Tatum is willing it to go. And you know, his height and quick release helped Tatum do work in the post. Defense can only do so much. Irving against Gilgis Alexander. And no doubt they'd love to see him get a lot more of those opportunities. And that deficit will go away quickly if he does, Greg. Well, I like the way he capped off that drive. The one-hand hole punch. KD with the bundle. Defender all over Durant, and he still gets it to go. Well done. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Gilgis Alexander against Irving. And a wide open look here for Wiggins. Off target from three-point range. Fires top of the key. And that one goes long. And we've reached halftime in this one. Leading by 10. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. Kevin, what has allowed you all to build this lead in the first half? Well, we've just been playing hard. Those guys are tough to guard. They cut so hard. They play well together. And uh, uh, we had a decent half. we got to keep it going. Kevin, thanks a lot. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks so much, David. And we'll step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after this break. Welcome, everybody. Now, Shaq, you once said that all the real big men are extinct because you killed them off. That would be a correct to my... And back to the matchup at hand. Everything has been going smoothly for the visiting team. Thanks for spending half time. And we've got third quarter of basketball for you. Two quarters in the books. Look at LeBron James. He's really been playing well. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters and you know what it helped that they had a few guys with very hot hands on the perimeter too Barrett is out there with Kelly Olenek then there's Dwight Powell then there's Murray and it's Gilgis Alexander into the one spot we've got Durant Stephen Curry's out there with Booker and it's LeBron James and it's Davis in at the center and it's fun to watch guys like Booker that see the floor this well seems to always get it to the right man you know, Clark, when he's 100%, Anthony Davis, one of the premier big men in the game. Hey, I would take that qualifier off of it, Kevin. How about just one of the best players, period? He can pick and pop, he can pick and roll, he can post up. He can do everything offensively and defensively. He's unique as a rim protector with the ability to defend on the perimeter, too. Durant commands so much attention, part of the reason why he had a wide-open teammate there. It's stolen by Curry. Here's the break. 
and then to Rick with the dunk. Assisted. And their balanced Stephen effort Curry. at both ends has hushed this crowd. Yeah, you said the key word there, balanced. I mean, their big oh, lead team. owes as much to their defense as their offense. Stats for Gilgis Alexander. Last season, he played outstanding. He was around 31 points per, five assists, and five rebounds. And always nice to have a guy like him who can really defend at a high level coming off the bench. You know, when you can sub in a lockdown defender, that's a major plus. And Pierce brings it in. And you see the edge Barrett plays with attacking the rim with bad intentions. Here's James, and that one drops for him. James. LeBron's got 10 points. Uh, unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flames. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming, attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. Curry deciding where to go with it. Shoots over Gilgis Alexander. Stephen Curry. And there's Stephen Curry on the assist by Davis. Anthony Off a Davis. pass, Steph Curry. That one is always going in, or almost always going in. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Stolen by Durant. Pushing it up. The pass to LeBron. A three ball. The buzzer beater. Yeah, now they are firing on all cylinders. That shot puts three more onto their lead as we head to the fourth. The three quarters of play all in the books, and this one all but over already. Delivering the blowout. And do not go away. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? And how about the big fella here showing us he's got some point guard skill here with the tremendous setup. Hey, that was a high-level pass no matter what position it came from. But it does make it stand out a little more when it's made by the big fella. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. Jamal Murray is out there with Gilgis Alexander. First then it's Olenek. Then there's Dwight Powell. And it's Barrett in at the three spot. At the line. Coaches the say, GA, the league Stephen has Curry. a problem when it's punishing the retaliators and not the instigators. Do they have a point? Kevin, I think so. Uh, for any scuffle, it's worth asking who started it. And, and that's what we do in life normally, right? Here we are looking around the NBA. Greg, it feels like there's more parity amongst teams than ever before. No dominant team has been the favorite every year. And that can all change, though, in a heartbeat. Every so often, a dynasty can be born. Well, you look at Culver and you watch his game. He's a tough two guard now. He's strong, he's got good length, and he's very skilled. Lillard dishes to Williamson. Culver with the steal. Butler against Dort. Pass to Alexander Walker. Back to Dort. Over Butler. And Dort gets it to go. Very good inside. Dort's got great upper body strength. Outside Curry to the wing right side. Lillard from outside. Rebound by Alexander Walker. About a minute played here in the fourth quarter. Wiggins outside. There's the pick. Goes back up. No good at the rim. I'm a fan of anybody who defends that way. I mean, they weren't about to open the door and just allow him to cruise in for a layup. Help that one. And they came in determined to take this one. It's going to be a happy flight home. Yep, to have a stress-free win on the road, very satisfying. The fans are already headed for the exits. Alexander Walker passes to Brooks. Good D by Williamson. And they can just let the clock run out here. Cannot argue with the W. And here's Tatum for three. 
Kentucky can't get it to go. Now here's Brooks. Knocks it loose. And so it's a victory for the road team in this one. That's this crowd was game. stunned by the manner in which their team was dismantled. Thanks, you know what? Shock. I don't care what the matchup is. You never expect a road team to come in and just cruise to the kind of win they did tonight. And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. Brown, when you know AD is behind you, how does that help you defensively? You can stay home. You can allow him to play one-on-one -on -one versus a guard versus a big, and you can stay home and be able to box out and get rebounds because he's that good. It's quite a one-two punch, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. Much appreciated, David. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our